Hi, this is Deborah Fran Baker, Mama Deb, and welcome to my check-in. A little noisy here because it's very hot, and the best way to get air into what is now my office is with a fan. We don't have air conditioning here. We have the rest of the house, just not here. All right, let's do the check-in, and I'm going to say right now it is not good. Here's the daily page. Green is uh, last week. And as you note, it's Monday and it's Friday. And that's it. I can give a bunch of excuses. Part of it is, and some of them are true. We had my periodic uh, check-in with my therapist. We had my, these new bookcases de delivered, which I will show you. And we had our declutter to come in and help fill the bookcases all of which disrupt the schedule a lot however I also did not move my car when I should have I did not do my shopping on Thursday which I when I should have there were things that were not done I am not happy and part of it is because I neglected this this is why I do this the check-in the check-in is necessary to prove to myself that I actually do this <laughs> I did pay that. Okay. I mean, here's the weekly chart. Note how often I took my blood sugar. Exactly. I did take my... And the no phone stuff also disappeared. It was just not good. However, I'm feeling well today, so it's going to happen. I promise. Here, let's um, play a room. I don't. That's our new page for this anyway. So, we are, Rosh Kodesh was yesterday. We are definitely in the period of the nine days. So, I do have a menu plan to talk about here when I do my menu planning. Let's take these off. This is my nine days menu plan. Nine days, I am not allowed to have meat. That means beef, lamb, chicken, turkey, anything that comes from a land animal. I cannot have it. I can't have, I can't have fish. So, today is Sunday. We're going to see my mother. Since it's not outrageously hot and I don't have her cold, so I can actually see her. Yay! There's a new Turkish kosher restaurant close to them, and they have delicious sounding vegetarian dishes. I am very happy about that. Monday is the tortilla. Tortilla is a Spanish tortilla, so it's basically a egg, potato, and whatever else I want in it uh, casserole. I'm planning on putting in potatoes, uh, excuse me, tomatoes, and cheese, and possibly vegetarian sausages. You know, little morning or farm sausages. It's so yummy. Tuesday is going to be pizza for me. I'm going to a concert in violation of so many rules. Uh, le leftover tortilla on Wednesday. Thursday, I have salmon in my freezer. Therefore, we are going to have salmon. Friday, Friday night is Shabbat. There is no morning on Shabbat. So we're going to have meat. I'm making a London broil. And the next day, Saturday, we're going to have that cold in a salad. I'm also going to make a chicken pasta dish uh, for a late afternoon meal. We're supposed to have one anyway but in this case it's the last we have to eat before 8 o'clock. I find that uh, a protein pasta dish is a really good pre-fast meal. It's gonna be a full meal we're going to have. An appetizer we're going to have a dessert, the dessert will probably be, a dessert will probably be a fruit salad because again fruit salad works really well at the last thing before going on a long fast and the fast is on, is for 25 hours it ends on Sunday night we will break the fast with V8 juice and bagels and salt fish and such the goal was that we wouldn't have fish every single day we wouldn't have rice every single day or pasta 
I seem to have managed that by not having rice or pasta every any day though I might do uh, either noodles or rice rice pilaf as a side dish for the salmon probably will unless I do it for Friday night that doesn't sound bad either okay <laughs> So this is the weekly plan. Let me start adding the color. I'll speed this bit up. Okay, so let's get the meal plan written in here. Okay, let's look at the weekly stuff. Well, it's a timesheet. I'm going to put down move car, even though I don't know if I'm going to have to or not. Depends where I park when I come back from my mom's. Move car. Yes, I'm. Yes, I am excited. Um, <laughs> okay, laundry, shopping, cooking, Gisela, Shabbat, which comes in. At, let me check my monthly calendar for that. Um, 744. Okay. Starts 8 p.m. Fast ends. Again, let's check the, check the monthly calendar. I wrote that down. 844. That's about right. Tisha B'Av. Well, technically speaking, Tisha means tenth, and the tenth of the month of Av is Shabbos, but we don't mourn on Shabbos, so we pushed it off one day so that we can do it properly. Okay, and that is my plans for the coming week. Oh, actually, let's change that. Let's have a little tour of my current configuration for my room. Basically, lovely. Basically, I have bookcases. Yes, I have boxes too, but I have bookcases. This is the one that's meant to be all mine. You can tell that because the bottom level is all uh, graphic novels, and then we have my there we have my cookbooks, my um, knitting books, actually here are my knitting books, and up here on the top shelf we have my antiques. We're still figuring out this shelf. And this entire bookcase we're still also figuring out. The ones to my right belong to my husband. <laughs> 